Problem number two, the following data consists of the weights and pounds of 15 randomly selected women and the weights of 15 randomly selected men. Consider the stem and leaf diagrams for the sample below. So we have women and we have men, and we have to answer the following questions. Uh, they have the same mean, they have the same, same range, and they have the same standard deviation. We have various options here. So the way to do this is to take these numbers and plug them into StatCrunch, which I've already done here. So here you see 110, uh, that's the same thing as 110, right? And then 111, that's the same thing as 111, etc. Um, and so you can type uh, these numbers in. Same thing with the men. If you look at the first number uh, here under the column where it says men, you have 136, that's 136 pounds, etc. You type everything in, and then you go to Stat, Summary Stats, and then you go to Columns. And uh, you select both uh, variable 1 and variable 2. So to do that, you, you can hold Control down and then just pick both. And then just click Compute. And it gives us all of these summary statistics. So uh, do they have the same mean? Uh, no, they don't, right? The means are different. Do they have the same, stand the same range? Uh, they do. The range is 63 in both cases, right? So 63 in both cases. And do they have the same standard deviation to one decimal? Um, no, they don't, right? The first one is 20.4. The second one is 20.3. It's almost the same, uh, but it's not. So uh, the on they only have the same uh, range. So let's see. That, that, would, that would be that um, choice number two is, is true. And so the answer here would be A. All right, two only, so the distributions have the same range. So uh, again, first thing you do is you take these numbers and you just type them into StatCrunch, right? So like 137 is just 137, uh, 139 is 139, etc. Then you go to Stat, Summary Stats, and then you go to Columns, left click, hold Control, pick both, click Compute, and then just compare uh, what it's asking you to compare. So it's asking you to compare the means, uh, the standard deviations and the ranges. They're all different except the ranges. I hope this video has been helpful. That's it.